Good morning, Patriots! Welcome to Rex Pines TV. I'm yours, Daniel Lorenzo. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I, I pledge, pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today's Thursday, February 18th, 2021. Let's go to Aiden for our Black History Spotlight. Thank you, Yosudani. Today we spotlight African American fashion designer Anne Lowe, who designed the wedding dress of Jacqueline Kennedy Onassis the bride of future president, John F. Kennedy. I'm sure this is a little known fact, but it's amazing that the designer for one of the most beloved first ladies wedding dress designer was a woman of color. Now let's go to Chris for the sports highlight. Thank you, Aiden. Today's sports highlights are presented to you by the Patriots. Australian daredevil Robbie Madison surfs giant wave on his dirt bike. Freestyle motocross maestro Robbie Madison is well known for his heart-stopping stunts. In 2014, he performed several backflips over stationary airplanes at the Military Service Aircraft Graveyard in Tucson, Arizona. However, it doesn't compare to his latest stunt, surfing a wave on a slightly modified KTM dirt bike. One of the challenges that Madison had to face was how to remodel the bike so it would be able to stay on the water. After over two years of extensive planning and training, Madison was finally ready for the big day. Now let's go to Noah to see what's for lunch. Thank you, Aiden. Today's lunch is chicken nuggets, baby carrots, ranch, french fries, orange, and milk. What about tea? Now let's go back to you, Stani. Thank you, Noah. Scholars, we're almost there. Only nine more days left in the February I Ready Challenge. The I Ready Challenge is focused on reading only. Pass 30 I Ready reading lessons between February 1st and February 26th to join your classmates at the awesome sub party. Let's go strong to the finish line. Patriots, if you remind us for important events and activities that are ongoing and coming up this week and next. School picture days are today and tomorrow. Today is kindergarten through third grade and tomorrow will be fourth grade through eighth grade. Be sure to wear the appropriate shirt for your grade. Virtual students that wish to take pictures must sign up through the email sent out to parents and come in today to have their picture taken. There will be no makeup pictures. Also, today is an early release day, so students will be getting out of school at 1 p.m. today. Next week on Monday, February 22nd, our Scholastic Book Fair begins. It will run until March 7th. Keep an eye out for additional announcements as we get closer. Also, next week, We'll be having a Kahoot Trivia Night on February 24th at 4.30. More details coming soon. Patriots, we continue celebrating Black History. Today we'll be watching a YouTube video on Alvin Alley, American Dance Theater. Teachers, please incorporate this in class for you and your students. Tomorrow we get to show off our sports allegiance. It's where your favorite black athlete day. Who is your favorite black athlete? I can't wait to find out. Be sure to tune in every day to find out what fun activity or dress down will be going on during the rest of February. Teachers, you can share videos with us on RPTV by emailing pines.renaissance at gmail.com or uploading to the RPTV OneDrive. Now, let's see what the weather is going to be like today with David. Thank you, Peyton. Today's weather in Pembroke Pines, Florida is forecast to be 84 degrees Fahrenheit and poly cloudy. Let's all take advantage of this great Florida weather. Now it's got a sermon for the joke of the day. Thank you, David. And here's today's joke of the day. What do porcupines say when they kiss? Ouch! Now let's go to Solomon for today's birthdays. Thanks, Samuel. That was hilarious. Today's birthday boys and girls are Jamise Reese, Michael Walensky, Zaniah Williams, and Kamari Noel. Happy birthday! Now let's go back to you, Donnie. Thank you, Sonia. Patriots, don't forget your path to expectations. It represents, present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school as the environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats to Miss Rivera, Miss Newton, Miss Antori, Miss Stone, 
Miss Hendrickson, Miss Anne Dinkwa, Miss Kane, and Miss Moraz. You all had the correct answer to yesterday's riddle, which was, a bus driver was heading down a street in Colorado. He went right past the stop sign without stopping. He turned left where there was a no left turn sign, and he went on the wrong way on a one-way street. Then he went on the left side of the road, past a cop car. Still, he didn't break any traffic laws. Why not? The correct answer to the riddle was because he was walking. Now, for today's riddle. Before Mount Everest was discovered, what was the highest mountain on Earth? Again, before Mount Everest was discovered, what was the highest mountain on Earth? Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance.gmail.com before 10 a.m. in order for response to be reviewed. Winners will be announced the following day. Everyone on RBTV would like to wish you all a thankful Thursday. And don't forget, remember, reunite, rise. Have a great day.